Her family members say they want justice. KTV's David Stevenson has been following this story from the very beginning. David's live for us tonight in the city with the new action her family is taking. David? Garcia, this 22-page uh, claim is but the first legal step ahead of a lawsuit targeting San Francisco over what happened here at the hospital. Nearly six months after she first checked into San Francisco General Hospital, lawyers for the family of Lynn Spaulding are preparing to make the city pay for her death. If you were sitting on that jury, think how much money you might award for what happened to Lynn Spaulding. In October, the 57-year-old mother of two was found dead in a stairwell 17 days after she disappeared from her hospital bed. Today, attorney Haig Harris said he's filed a claim with the city, the first step toward a full-fledged lawsuit. The claim alleges violations of the elder abuse and adult dependency statute, allowing Spaulding's family to seek damages far beyond a $250,000 medical malpractice cap. It also allows the family, the estate, if you will, her children, to recover for her emotional distress, which usually dies when the person dies. Harris says the hospital failed to provide a safe atmosphere for patients. He cites a haphazard search by sheriff's deputies for the missing woman and a stairwell exit alarm he says went unheeded. Once out on that fire escape, it's a trap. Uh, it says exit. You go outside, but you can't get back in. Harris That's says he expects to sue rather than quickly settle the claim with the city. The city attorney has 45 days to either approve or deny the claim. We're going to take a careful look at its merits. And even as the first legal steps were taken, there are still ongoing investigations into Spalding's death. At 6, we'll let you know what we've been checking in today and found out about the Sheriff's Department investigation into what happened here at San Francisco General Hospital. For now, reporting live in San Francisco, David Stevenson, KTVU, Channel 2 News.